racing away from the 1800 meter marker. Towards the inside, Roy is slow as right there. Beretta Bobcat also with the orange cap as well plays. Los Barbados going around them. Ratso Risso is further back. Mandarb, that's in the blue near the rail with Sherman. Towards the outside is Sheriff Hood. Then we drop back further to Tower. Olorai is further back in the run. And then comes Goldings. And at the back of the field at this stage, it is Spice Roads. So settling down, Los Barbados, Ratso Rizzo's back in second position, Roya Slow is third, Sheriff Hood's back in fourth, then Beretta Bobcat, Alorai's on the outside, that's got the red cap, Mandob's in the blue, then we drop back to Tower, further back is Roy's Blitz and the trailer is Spice Roads, Goldings is on the outside of runners, about eight or nine lengths from top to tail. Los Barbados continues to lead it, in second, Radza Rizzo, Sheriff Hood's back in third. Fourth position, Roy is slow, Alarai. Then Beretta, Bobcat near the rail. Sherman is on the outside, then Goldings. Mandob's being asked to run, so is Tower. Roy's blood second to last, Spice Roads the trailer. Top of the lane they come, and the leaders, Los Barbados. On the outside, Sheriff Hood, Ratso Rizzo's down the inside. Roy is slow between runners, then comes Alarai. Sherman on the outside, but Sheriff Hood takes it up. Ratso Rizzo on the inside, Alarai's on the outside. Sheriff Hood still the leader, Ratso Rizzo, Roy is slow staying on. It's still Sheriff Hood the leader. Roy is slow is closing down, but still going is Sheriff Hood, and Sheriff Hood will win it. Roya Slow second, Rata Rosa third, and fourth, Alarai. Number seven, Sheriff Hood, the Rip Van Winkle, Tony Rivelin, Mary Liley, and they win it. It is the 13th time at the track. Warren Kennedy is the winning rider. And they come home about a length and a half to two lengths. The victor, number seven. Second will go to number two, Roy is slow. Third to number one, the tote favourite, Ratso Rizzo. Fourth to Alarai, who I said was a good place bet, went down very nicely. Then Sherman, further back, Beretta Bobcat, followed by Goldings. And then came Spice Rose, a little bit keen on the way to the start. No extra from Los Barbados. As we look at the head on, the big white nose band, and that is your winner, and that's Sheriff Hood, who comes forward and is chased home by Roy is slow. Number seven, Sheriff Hood paid 430 and two Rand, and number two, Roy is slow. It pays up a good 290, or rather 170 a place. Toad favorite number one. Until the running of the second race, back to the studio. Just see number seven, Sheriff Hood, come through to win. And he's come through to win with a little bit of authority coming to the last 200 metres. Tony Rivelin joining us. Ohosu, he looked well. And that draw he overcame in his penultimate run. So well done to Warren. Yeah, Warren rode him very well. Um, I was worried that he can over race if he hasn't got cover. So we wanted him in the first half of the field. But, you know, I was a little nervous would he get cover. But he was very relaxed in the race today. And once I saw him not pulling, then he was in the perfect position. Warren was right, you know, it wasn't the greatest of fields. You don't want to get caught in behind horses that may be stopping on you before they turn for home. And um, this was his bread to actually go two miles. So, you know, you, it's, it's better if he can settle up there. Um, he can use his stamina. And well done to Warren, well done to Mary. And, um, yeah. You got your bread and butter horses coming up throughout the evening. How would you rate their chances and who would possibly be your next best? You got Jesui, Silver, Show Me Your Rosie, a number of them in their heats. The next one, Spanish captain, um, who's working extremely well, but I think it's a very competitive race. He's drawn a little wide. Um, you've got to catch him on his day. He's not genuine, unfortunately. Show me your Rosie's very well, but um, I think she's going to battle to beat Jeff Freeman's horse there, Burnwood. I think that's got a claim for, and you know the form hasn't stood up from her maiden win, but I must say she's working very well. So that's in her favour. Um, 
then where do we go from there? Josie Silva, tough race, but I've gone for the claim four, and um, she, she doesn't know how to run a bad race, I'm sure. It's, with a bit of luck, it's as long as she jumps well, because she can play around in the gates a little bit, and if she's in the right position, a good chance, and then I think Lajotan will win the last. Thanks for that. Thank you. Warren Kennedy riding Count von Count and now bringing home Sheriff Wood in the same colours. Just the draw to overcome? Yes, Sheldon, just the draw to overcome. But like I said, I'm very fortunate to ride Mrs. Lai's horses and for Mr. Rivland, you know, they give me the opportunities when they come and I'm just glad to win for them. Tony mentioned he's a horse who can get a little bit keen, but he seemed to settle well enough? He settled like a dream, Sheldon. He came out, they went, they went on a bit for maidens, everyone looking for a good position, but um, I kept him out there. Didn't want to get stuck behind all the stragglers, you know, I was, as it proves, the best horse in the race. So I just bided my time. I started him one off the fence in the open, but he was, he was beautifully settled. And they slowed it up quite, quite a bit, coming to about the 1,000 metre mark. And I was able to just slide up to them without asking us to do anything. And top of the straight, I, I was full of running, you know. I, I asked him to quicken. His run was smooth. And with these maidens, that's the way it's got to be, yeah. Looking at your rides coming up, who would possibly be your next best? I know you've got some each way prospects. Yeah, look, my next best without a doubt is uh, Roy's Rolls Royce. You know, I think it's the right distance for him. He loves the poly track. He's in good form. Um, unfortunately, my horses Noodle and Tyrant's Jet are, are scratching, so those are probably the next two. But um, yeah, Roy's Rolls Royce is probably my next best. Well done. Thank you. Mrs. Mary Lyle going to join us. We had a chat the other day with Count von Kant. Lovely to see Sheriff Hood come through and win. Thank you very much. Yes, it is lovely because he's had lots of problems. And um, anyway, thank goodness he's over them. And hopefully he can go on with it now. And thanks to Tony and Warren, who's riding like a star. And just hope for the best. Enjoy the victory and all the best. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well done to Mary Lally, Sheriff Hood, the Rip and Winkle has come through, Warren Kennedy doing the honours.